Hi, Sagittarius. It's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and get into it, Sag. Thank you, God, for blessing the Sagittarius with a clear, concise message from you. Okay, so let's see what's going on for you. What's going on for the Sagittarius? And happy birthday, Sagittarius. The Ten of Wands. All right, so could be moving, could be carrying a lot of burdens. Could be in a love relationship where you just don't feel like you don't know where it's going. You just feel like there's a lot of doing but there's no set intention. There's no set destination. It's just like we just keep carrying on here. But where is it really going? Um, You can't see the forest for the trees here. You don't know, will this manifest into anything real or will it be realized? Some of you, if you're single, then you need to stay single because there's some things you need to examine within yourself. Yeah, the four of swords, some of you need to get some rest. Or you will be getting some rest. Some of you could be dealing with uh, a Libra here. Um, some of you are just thinking about the future. Again, coupled with the Ten of Wands and then the Four of Swords, it's like, I don't know where this is going. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know. I feel like I'm wandering. Uh, this has been an uphill battle, a struggle each and every day, or I'm struggling each and every day with this person, with this job, whatever. I need to make some plans for my future with the Four of Swords. Let's see, uh, futuristic plans. You, also, it talks about a relationship, make it or break it time. Somebody, you could have taken a break from someone because there was suspicion of infidelity on your part or the other person's, I don't know. Um, but you understand that this is make it or break it time, okay? You could be coming back from vacation, going back into work also. Let's see. What is the advice for Sag? Uh, eight of pentacles work on yourself put work into yourself some of you are so focused with work maybe even being a workaholic to to the point where you're just not even concerned about love of uh, you're not putting a lot of time into love you also feel like you have given a relationship a uh, uh, chances over and over and over again nothing has manifest some of you are being very prudent with your money watching where your money goes someone doesn't like that or they they're not used to that the Eight of Pentacles says that someone could be thinking about you over and over again. Somebody is more invested, maybe even financially, monetarily, well, that's the same, but energetically uh, than the other person. What is this? What is the advice? What's the advice? Uh, Nine of Swords. Wow. This is a lot of turmoil. Like somebody can't really cope with the fact that, you know, I need to be done with this. I don't even know how to be done with it, but I know I need to be done with it. This causes me a lot of sleepless and restless nights. This person is a lot of drama. Um, somebody um, could work at night or a night shift or somebody's doing something at night that causes another person a lot of drama, a lot of stress. Someone can't sleep because they don't know what the other person is doing or what they're up to. There could be some health-related issues here, either underlining or you know about them. Um, somebody's sleep pattern is off. There could be an insomniac the outcome here what is the outcome the door is what i heard oh the door darling all right the outcome what's the outcome the knight of cups the knight of wands the three of wands and the queen of pentacles some of you trying to go back to somebody from your past oh definitely i don't know if all this night energy you got the knight of pentacles showing up I don't know if this person will feel like you're serious. Uh, somebody's trying to expand elsewhere. Somebody feels like their expansion, their growth, everything is somewhere else. And they're waiting for it. They're waiting for this person to come back. Or they're waiting for an opportunity. They're waiting for communication. They're waiting for the perfect time. Somebody feels like with someone else, every aspect of their life was on point it was great it was beautiful it was maturing it was manifesting it was whatever someone could want to go back to the mother of their children or child to a very um very well put together woman you know she's got her stuff together someone is staying with the mother of their child and leaving maybe this night energy Somebody wants more of a committed, solid, dedicated, devoted relationship. And they found that elsewhere. Somebody is also understanding their worth. 
So they're leaving this night energy behind. This falling in love, having sex, having fun times, and then nothing manifesting. They're leaving it behind because they're understanding their worth in terms of what they bring to the table, any table. They're understanding that they're a good catch. This could be you, Sag. It could be the other person. This is what I have for you. If it resonates, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Uh, yeah, let me know how it resonates for you. Also, you can go over to the website, book your own reading there. You could learn the tarot with me too. The The classes uh, for the learning the tarot are linked below. And also you could catch me on keen.com. Yep, you could talk to me for 10 minutes. We have a 10 minute chat for $1.99. The link is below, uh, keen.com. Um, this is what I have for you, Sag. Uh, thank you. Many blessings to you. Happy birthday and take care.